nearly Christmas time and three decades since this Band Aid single became the greatest selling charity song of all time. Well, Enjoy the wave of nostalgia because to mark its 30th anniversary, Bob Geldof is reportedly resurrecting a new version. Yes, enter One Direction. The boys have become the first big names believed to be confirmed for the new Band-Aid single. Admittedly, they weren't even born when the song was first released in 1984, but the 80s are now at least retro. And Channel 5 News understands these are some of the other acts who have got the call from Geldof. It's thought David Bowie could make an appearance. The Bastille boys are apparently signed up, as is its believed Coldplay, while Florence Welch, it's thought, has been approached... Critics say for the stars there can be no bigger honour than Band-Aid. I think every artist wants it. It's got such a history attached to it. And it's a great cause. It kind of doesn't matter what the song's like. Obviously you hope it's going to be good. It doesn't matter if it's rubbish because the cause is so good and it's part of a history, you know. Hello. It's thought Bob Geldof has decided to re-record the hit to raise money for the Ebola crisis in Africa. And there won't be snow in Africa this Christmas time. It bodes well then that when the song was re-released in 2004, it became the fastest selling single of the year. But do you still know the words? Oh, the clanging chimes of doom. Well, tonight, thank God it's them instead of you. And there won't be snow in Africa this Christmas time. And the greatest gift they'll get this year is life. When nothing, nothing ever, ever grows. Or as it flows, grows. Let them know it's Christmas time. Truth, perhaps our rendition wasn't the greatest gift, but rumour has it the new Band-Aid single will be released later this month. Minnie Stevenson, 5 News.